Do you use the internet at all? Yes, I do. Yeah, yeah quite a lot, in yeah. fact. Do you use it to uh, gather news, to uh, like a newspaper? But um... well, I I'm, I surf around a lot, actually. Uh, I tend to look for uh, new sites and get information that is not so common in newspapers, for example. And do you feel that when you get information from the internet that you can trust it to be true? Uh, do you feel comfortable that it's, it's real? Well, you can never trust information, <laughs> uh, even from the newspapers. Uh, the newspapers sometimes print uh, information that is not true for the mere fact that it comes from uh, sources that are not true. And the same goes for internet. I get news from internet more than a newspaper or uh, watching TV. Um, I think it's uh, in terms of speed and how, how fast uh, it gets to people, I think internet is very good. Um, um, in terms of credibility, I think, um, well, I think it's almost the same thing, um, internet, newspaper, and um, news on TV. I probably put too much faith in what I read, although I try to use various sources in getting my news. That's one way I judge to know if I'm reading is, is you know, the truth or not. I. I get my news over the internet every day. I actually get three different newsletters uh, on a daily basis. I get one from Austria, I get one from the USA, and I get one from Great Britain. So I get international use, news and thus can also evaluate which news are really, in the end, the real news because I get them from all different sources. I don't believe everything I read, uh, whether it's on the internet or, or a newspaper, or if I listen to it on TV. Um, I do believe that there are credible sources out there, and if I've heard, if I've heard something or read something on the internet, um, if it comes from a credible source, then I, I tend to believe it. Um, there's a lot out there that's not too credible. You have to be very careful. Okay, and how do you try to be careful? Um, if it's spam email that comes or something that's from, from a source that I don't know, I tend not to, not to uh, put 100% trust into it. Uh, if it comes from the New York Times or if it comes from a reputable source, uh, I tend to take that for 100%.